So you're going to be giving yourself genomycin irrigation every other day in your home. And um, you will not be disconnecting your catheter. You will have a flip flow valve on there, so it's not going to be as involved as what I'm doing here. Um, yeah. But basically, I'm just going to disconnect you from this. Draw me up about 30 cc's in that syringe, would you? You're gonna feel cold and pressure in your bladder. I'm gonna go slow, okay? Okay. All I'm doing is flushing it. So if you've got any uh, kind of sludge in those eyelet holes in your catheter, it's gonna clear it. This is gonna feel weird. Oh, You're yeah. perfectly clear. There's nothing in there. All right. It does feel weird. Yeah, it feels weird. Mm. That is it, man. That is that. Come on, get in there. Uh, bubbly. Yeah. And that'll drain out. Okay. Put your butt for me so I can get this under your face. Good. Down. Alright. Okay. So, see this incision? When you're getting dressed, you have to make a decision which way this guy's going to go. He can't go straight up. I want you to always go away from this incision. I want you to go that way, okay? okay? This is where all the vessels, so this came from your leg this way. If you dress this way, if you push him this way, then you run the risk of crimping off all those blood vessels, okay? So I want you, if you have to make a decision, you go that way. Okay, but that's going to be right? the rest of my life. No. No. Oh, it's until it's like... Yeah, until you're healed and everything's a little softer. All right, see what you got. So bend your knees, and you're going to want to kind of crab yourself to the edge of the bed. It's going to feel like you're dragging your scrotum around, but you're not. They're up higher than you think. Okay? Good. And give yourself time to just kind of settle. Alright. So, I'm just going to have this stand first. I got you. It's connected to me. I don't know, it was touching my leg. I know it was on the floor. There's so, both feet on the floor. Okay. Huh? He's still, he's still, um, just yeah. stand. You're just going to stand up. Good. Okay, don't, don't support his weight. I want you to support all your weight. No, nope. come on back up. You can do it. Come on, there you go. Just stand. Uh, I'm dizzy. You know, that's why I, okay, that's okay. why I keep falling. Okay, dizzy. just stand. Just stand here. Give yourself some time to get over that dizziness. Your head's not been over your heart very much. You'll get better. Give yourself some time. Yep. Remember we talked about that superficial wound is gonna really bite at you, and it's true. It may even bleed. All right, just stand. You're not doing anything, just stand. straight up and down and keep your eyes open in front of you. Put your head together. There you go. There you go. Good. Stand normal. Good. Good. Take some steps in place. You're going to bend that leg that's going to hurt. You're going to have to bend it. It's called life. Good. Good. You're okay. No, no, I'm not worried about the camera. Look, look. We're going to worry about you right now, okay? okay You're not going to miss anything. There's nothing to miss here. You're just standing up. I want you to take a couple steps in place, get used to bending your knees. You need to get used to putting weight on that new graft site and weight on the bend of your knee. And this might crack and bend and bleed a little bit, and that's normal. But I need you to get used to using your legs because you're going to have to use them. So I want you to take some steps in place like this. Bend your knees. I just want to keep my steps about you. Bend your knees. Okay. Bend your knees and step in place. Can you walk up your right leg just about an inch? 
Look, I'm more worried about you than the camera right now. I need you to take some steps this in place. This is very important to me. I understand, but this is important to me, and I have to take care of you. Meaning, I'm not too worried about the camera. <sighs> Can you take some steps, please? There's nothing wrong with moving the camera, but I need to work on you. Let's walk out the door. Come on. What can I take my camera with me? Is Where are you going to hold it? We're holding you, and you gotta work on stuff, and no one's worried about your camera anymore. right now. Let's go. I never had my legs to today. No, nope, it's due at noon. It's due in 40 minutes. I'm getting upset right now. Okay. You don't have to walk. You don't have to get out of bed. You don't have to do anything. It's up just, to you. I just want to document this. I don't understand what the problem okay, is. Okay, step away. I got you. Step away. There's you. Let's go into the hall. Thanks. This way. I'm upset. I can't feel anything. I'm walking y'all. They didn't want me to record this for y'all so y'all see how it is for trans men to get surgery and getting out the bed walking for the first day. But I'll make sure I got the footage for y'all. I wish I could tell y'all how I feel but I can't feel right now. Y'all know how it is with my mental. But when I, I can say when I first got up, I did feel with my right hand, my leg, my left leg right here. It started cracking, all the hard blood started cracking. It, it started to sting. And then it started bleeding. I believe it did. Well, it's not bleeding like it did yesterday. Yesterday it started bleeding once I got up and started walking. Y'all, I'm dizzy. I'm real lightheaded, y'all. I'm real dizzy and lightheaded, y'all. Yeah. I feel like standing up straight hurt because you know, my tube. Now the doctor don't like me. It's whatever. All right, so let me show y'all something. I wanted to show y'all something. So I was asleep, and I keep doing this whenever I sleep, bro. I wake up, not wake up, but like I have like a muscle spasm where I flinch, and like my hand, it touch my my um my 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 skin grab, yo. And so I just did that. Look what happened, show. Look what happened. So form came off a little bit. Oh shit! Look at that. That just happened. I was nervous. And then like this right here. This came from the stapler. Like the staple. Like this was stapled into the stapler, but that bitch. I ripped it off on accident when I was sleeping. And then look, y'all. Uh, I took the stapler out because it wasn't no point. It was just sitting there, like it literally was just sitting right here, not touching nothing. So I took it, I took it, I took it out my leg. But yo, this jump hurt like hey. I wish that didn't happen, but damn. All right, y'all. I'm finna go back to sleep. I was sleeping before I did that, so I'm gonna go back to sleep.